The German National Library German, Deutsche National Bibliothek or DNB is the central archival library and national bibliographic center for the Federal Republic of Germany. Its task is to collect, permanently archive, comprehensively document and record bibliographically all German and German language publications since 1913, foreign publications about Germany, translations of German works, and the works of German-speaking emigrants published abroad between 1933 and 1945, and to make them available to the public. The German National Library maintains cooperative external relations on a national and international level. For example, it is the leading partner in developing and maintaining bibliographic rules and standards in Germany and plays a significant role in the development of international library standards. The cooperation with publishers has been regulated by law since 1935 for the Deutsche Bücherei Leipzig and since 1969 for the Deutsche Bibliothek Frankfurt. Duties are shared between the facilities in Leipzig and Frankfurt, with each center focusing its work in specific specialty areas. A third facility has been the Deutsches Musikarchiv Berlin founded 1970, which deals with all music-related archiving both printed and recorded materials. Since 2010 the Deutsches Musikarchiv is also located in Leipzig as an integral part of the facility there. History During the German revolutions of 1848 various booksellers and publishers offered their works to the Frankfurt Parliament for a parliamentary library. The library, led by Johann Heinrich Plath, was termed the Reichsbibliothek Reich library". After the failure of the revolution the library was abandoned and the stock of books already in existence was stored at the Germanisches Nationalmuseum in Nuremberg. In 1912, the town of Leipzig, seat of the annual Leipzig Book Fair, the Kingdom of Saxony and the Borsanverein der Deutschen Buchhandler Association of German Booksellers agreed to found a German national library in Leipzig. Starting January 1, 1913, all publications in German were systematically collected including books from Austria and Switzerland. In the same year, Dr. Gustav Wall was elected as the first director. In 1946 Dr. Georg Kurt Schauer, Heinrich Kobet, Vittorio Klostermann and Professor Hans Wilhelm Eppelsheimer, director of the Frankfurt University Library, initiated the re-establishment of a German archive library based in Frankfurt. The federal state representatives of the book trade in the American zone agreed to the proposal. The city of Frankfurt agreed to support the planned archive library with personnel and financial resources. The U.S. military government gave its approval. The library began its work in the tobacco room of the former Rothschild Library, which served the bombed university library as accommodation. As a result, there were two libraries in Germany, which assumed the duties and function of a national library for the later GDR and the Federal Republic of Germany, respectively. Two national bibliographic catalogues almost identical in content were published annually. With the reunification of Germany on 3 October 1990, the Deutsche Bucherei Leipzig and the Deutsche Bibliothek Frankfurt am Main were merged into a new institution, the German Library Die Deutsche Bibliothek. The law regarding the German National Library came into force on 29 June 2006. The expansion of the collection brief to include online publications set the course for collecting, cataloging and storing such publications as part of Germany's cultural heritage. The library's highest management body, the Administrative Council, was expanded to include two MPs from the Bundestag. The law also changed the name of the library and its buildings in Leipzig, Frankfurt am Main and Berlin to Deutsche National Bibliothek, German National Library. In July 2000, the DMA also assumed the role as repository for GEMA, Gesellschaft für Musikalische Aufführungs- und Mechanische Vervielfaltigungsrecht, a German music copyright organization. Since then, music publishers only have to submit copies to DMA, which covers both national archiving and copyright registration. The 210,000 works of printed music previously held by GEMA were transferred to DMA. German exile archive and controversy 
One of the special activities of the German National Library involves the collection and processing of printed and non-printed documents of German-speaking emigrants and exiles during the period from 1933 to 1945. The German National Library maintains two exile collections, the Collection of Exile Literature 1933–1945 of the German National Library in Leipzig and the German Exile Archive 1933–1945 of the German National Library in Frankfurt am Main. Both collections contain printed works written or published abroad by German-speaking emigrants as well as leaflets, brochures and other materials produced entirely or in part by German-speaking exiles. In 1998 the German National Library and the German Research Foundation began a publicly funded project to digitize the Jewish Periodicals in Nazi Germany collection of approximately 30,000 pages, which were originally published between 1933 and 1943. Additionally included in the project were 30 German-language emigrant publications, German-language exile journals 1933–1945 consisting of around 100,000 pages. These collections were put online in 2004 and were some of the most frequently visited sites of the German National Library. In June 2012 the German National Library discontinued access to both collections on its website for legal reasons. The digitized versions are since then available for use in the reading rooms of the German National Library in Leipzig and Frankfurt am Main only, which caused partly harsh criticism. The German National Library cited concerns over copyright as the reason, claiming that although the library and the German Research Foundation had permission from the owners of the publication to put them online, the ownership of the «orphaned articles», that is, the individual authors, could not be ascertained as would be necessary because German legislation does not include a «fair use clause». The Jewish-German language newspaper Hagelil called the library's action «overzealous». Eve Kugelmann, the head of Judish Median AG in Zurich, which owns the rights to Aufbau magazine, one of the Exile Archives offerings, called the action completely absurd, confusing, and without merit. Dr. Ann Lipp of the German Research Foundation concluded that all projects of the foundation, which have been paid for by public funding and with the intent of publishing online, must be made public. Dr. As Moose, head of Deutsches Exilarchiv, claims that the ownership of articles from over 13,000 individual authors must first be confirmed and permissions obtained before the 70 to 80 year old articles may be put online again, despite having had permission from the rightful owners of the publications to put the articles online. As Moose admits that there was not one single complaint of copyright violation. Meanwhile, other German and international institutions such as Compact Memory, the Leo Back Institute and Archive.org have no such compunctions and have begun restoring many of the deleted periodicals to the Internet again. <laughs> <laughs> German Music Archive The Deutsches Musikarchiv DMA, German Music Archive, is the central collection of printed and recorded music and the Music Bibliographic Information Center for Germany. It is a federal agency founded in 1970, tasked with collecting all music published in the country. Its precursor was the Deutsche Musik Phonothek (1961–1969). The DMA moved to Leipzig in 2010 to be housed in an extension of the Deutsche Nationalbibliothek. Construction work began in 2006 and was completed in 2009. Formerly situated in berlin Lankwitz, the DMA constitutes a department of the German National Library Deutsche National Bibliothek. Publishers of printed and recorded music in Germany are required by law since 1973 to deliver two copies of every edition to the archive. One copy is kept at the DMA in Leipzig, the second is deposited in Frankfurt. Building in Leipzig Coordinates, 51 degrees 19 minutes 20.44 seconds north 12 degrees 23 minutes 48.11 seconds east The main building of the German National Library in Leipzig was built 1914–1916 after plans of the architect Oskar Pusch. The impressive facade is 160 meters long and faces the Deutscher Platz. German Plaza. The building was opened on October 19, 1916. The site of the library had been donated by the city of Leipzig, while Friedrich August III, King of Saxony provided the funds for the building. 
On the façade, the portraits of Otto von Bismarck, Johann Wolfgang von Goethe and Johannes Gutenberg are displayed. Statues represent technology, justice, philosophy, medicine etc. The central reading room contains a picture by Ludwig von Hoffmann, depicting Arcadia in Art Nouveau style. The staircase displays a mural showing the founders of the German library. The library also contains a museum for books and letters. An extension was completed in 2010. Topic: <inaudible> Inventory. Total: 29.7 million items. Leipzig: 17.4 million items. Frankfurt am Main: 10.8 million items. Online publications: 1. 5 million items Topic See also German National Library of Economics ZBW German National Library of Medicine ZB Med German National Library of Science and Technology TIB List of libraries in Germany the collection of German prints Sammlung Deutscher Druck or SDD Integrated Authority File Gemensame Normdate or GND Books in Germany